hi so I'm back and the backup is finished as I can see this is the Friday rsync log and it's 12.9 megabytes wow so it's up to you if you want to make a script to empty that out but at the end of this log file you can see here total size is and speed okay and there are no errors so that means maybe the rsync has, has been um, successfully backed up so also we go to the others and the home Okay, the rsync log here if you go to the on the bottom it's total size okay so we're pretty much sure it's successful now it's already here the whole system is uh, good to go and we've backed up the whole system now the only way we need to test this is if we are gonna um, put a live CD and delete all those files our system and then we will restore them okay so that's uh, gonna be the next tutorial but before all this I just want to make um, something a side note for uh, for you or uh, uh, extra information okay when you have a hard disk you have the what you call the MBR okay the MBR is located the very first sector of the f hard disk it's 512 uh, KB 512 bytes okay this 500 bytes is located at the very first uh, sector of your hard disk and this is what you also call the MBR what the MBR does is that it goes to it goes to the different partitions reads the partitions and where the OSS are located okay so maybe you have here a partition for windows you have here for ubuntu okay and maybe you have here for mac what 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 have you okay it's different partitions so the 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 job of the f uh, master boot record is from the first sector of the hard disk it will read what is here so that when for example this is a Linux machine and this is a Windows when it comes to the Linux machine okay it will um, it will boot okay and it will use now the grub okay um, actually the grub is located here okay now Windows wipes this out that's why when you dual boot something the it's it's very important that you install li Windows first and then after you install Windows you install Linux because it has a grub and it will install it in the first 512 bytes sector of the hard disk and it can read all the partitions and the OS inside your hard disk okay now what we're next tutorial I'm gonna make a video now so that you can actually it's just easy to make and uh, to back up the MBR okay later we're gonna produce that in our script and add that so now I'm gonna boot into a boot CD and then we will delete the files there and then we will restore so that we can see Ubuntu uh, was deleted and then it was restored okay